A WSU sports management student put together a bowling tournament at Zeppos. Our reporter Chris Mitchell went on Sunday to see how it went down. The Bowling for Soup fundraiser took place this past Sunday here in Pullman. Bowling for Soup is a food drive for the Community Action Center that was followed up by a bowling tournament. Brian Hooker is a sports management major that was on the team that put this event together. We're going to have like a food drive before um, the actual bowling tournament. And the way the food drive is going to work is you can bring up to 20 items. And from those items, you can boost your individual score. Uh, so it's kind of an incentive to bring and donate. The incentives that Hooker spoke about were realized by participants like Daniel Cowles. Each of us on our team, we got a couple cans because like helps add to our score because we're going to need it. But it's fun to see all the different people here to like support the different people for their little program and stuff. Garrett Vale, a team member, reminds the community that everything raised and donated solely goes towards helping the Pullman Community Action Center. All of 100% of our uh, proceeds are going straight to the Community Action Center here in Pullman. So that's our main benefactor of this tournament. In addition to collecting food items, monetary donations were also accepted, according to Carlos Sanchez, a member of the team running this event. Now we're already making profits. We have a few, at least $500 going to the Community Action Center after today. So. In total, there were 340 items donated during this event across the 14 teams that participated, which was to Hooker's pleasant surprise. Yeah, it's going really well. Uh, we have about 14 teams right now. Uh, we have a lot of donations. I don't know the exact amount yet, uh, but it's going really well. We were a little worried about not getting enough people to turn up, but uh, we've filled the place out and it's going great. With Muranuze and Pullman, I'm Chris Mitchell with Jake Gerard. Earth Week is coming to an end, and WSU.